In today's video, we're going to be looking at 8 best Roblox games to play. But before we begin this video, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. To enter our shoutout giveaway, simply comment, I subscribed, and you can be a lucky winner. Now, let's get right into today's video. On number 8, we have Scuba Diving at Quill Lake. In this game, you start off as a scuba diver for treasure and begin to find mysterious journal entries. There are quests that you can complete around the lake for rewards. There are also shops where you can buy and sell goods. The most mysterious of them is the Merlin's Shack, where you can buy scuba suits and learn about a powerful suit that must be crafted. The power cell is in the lava caves, the schematic being in the tower, and the helmet in a mysterious cave which you have to figure out yourself. The other part, however, is beneath the sunken ship. On number 7, we have Theme Park Tycoon 2. In this game, you get your own piece of land to build your own theme park together with your friends. You can construct a range of rides the way you want and design your own roller coasters to truly make the park your own. You can decorate your park further using hundreds of scenery pieces. On number 6, we have Work at a Pizza Place. In this game, you roleplay as different types of workers in a team doing real-world jobs in a pizza place to earn money and use your earnings to upgrade your house, buy furniture, and buy unique gear. It is one of the earliest and most popular games on Roblox. On number 5, we have Murder Mystery 2 It is a popular horror game on Roblox. It is the first game on Roblox to reach 10 million visits. In this game, a server holds up to 12 players, with one murderer, one sheriff, and 10 innocent at most. The sheriff is the only player that spawns with a gun, which they can use to protect the innocents. The innocents are unarmed and cannot harm the other players. Their purpose is to aid the sheriff by witnessing murders to figure out who the murderer is. If the gun is dropped by a killed sheriff, an innocent can pick it up, becoming the hero if they succeed in shooting the murderer. The murderer is the only player with a knife which can be used to kill the innocents and the sheriff. They must stealthily kill all the innocents and the sheriff before time runs out. The game features three modes, casual, hardcore, and assassin. You can always switch the modes anytime. On number four, we have Jailbreak. As the name suggests, it is a prison escape game. You can say it is the Roblox version of the Grand Theft Auto. In this game, your main goal depends on the team you join. A prisoner tries to break out of prison and become a successful criminal, which includes robbing stores and planning heists, such as the bank, jewelry store, or the museum. The police tries to keep prisoners in jail, arrest criminals, and stop robberies. The world of jailbreak is massive. There is tons of stuff to explore and discover. On number three, we have Super Bomb Survival. In this game, you and a group of others are dropped into a map, and bombs and missiles proceed to rain from the sky. The environment is destructible, meaning layers of terrain are wiped out by explosions, to the point that killer lava is eventually unearthed beneath you. As each round plays out, Quick movements and platforming skills become more and more important. But at the same time, you also have special abilities that you can use to jump insanely high or even create your own bombs. On number 2, we have Speedrun. In this game, your main goal is to speedrun on different maps and compete with your friends. Each map is a level and as you advance, they get more and more difficult. There are currently 31 levels in this game. And now, for number one. 
we have Hide and Seek Extreme. In this game, players must hide from the seeker for a period of time, otherwise you'll get caught and lose. When a new round starts, a random map is chosen 